I guess you, I would say. What's your favorite restaurant? Um, I like Mine's I Zaxby's. like El Cazador. You are Zaxby? Yeah, I like El Cazador. That's a Hispanic restaurant, and I like them. I like getting a uh, quesadilla, uh, veggie quesadilla. Well, just like cheese. I think it's like cheese, and they put they'll put peppers on it, like green bell peppers inside of it. If I ask, you know, if I ask them to chop it up, but um, I'll get that. And I forgot it's like a chul- not not a chul- not a chalupa. Uh, ah man, it's not, I can't think. It's something else that I would get. Um, it's like you get like two. Like you get like two a burrito. You can just make it yourself. I forgot what it's called. Oh, I don't, but it's like a. I don't know. I don't know. You get like sauteed peppers. I know what you're talking about. Stuff like that. Yeah, they get like a whole a big plate and they bring like two wraps out for you to make your own burrito or something like that. Yeah. Burritos is good. Bar burritos? No. You ever tried them? Burritos. Burritos. Oh, yeah. Burritos is fuck. You know what? But they, like, My favorite spot. Burritos and Moe's. They're, they're like the same, though. They are. Really. Burrito does. But burritos is They bigger, have fresher, better. F- fresher food and more authentic like food. Yeah. But. It's pretty much the same. Like you get, I guess you got more people to his the Hispanic races in there. Yeah, cooking the foods they do, and but you got more American people cooking the foods at Moe's. Yeah, it's American. Like I think, yeah. So I, the taste is different. I feel like, yeah, that's it's just like a a black, just like a black people gonna cook they black, gonna cook their fried chicken way better than anybody else gonna cook their fried chicken. Yeah, just be real with it. Even though Popeyes do be hitting. <laughs> Like you know, what Popeyes I'm saying? is the best fried chicken joint to me. Fried chicken from from your mama house gonna gonna taste, gonna, Pop, it's, yeah. It's probably gonna be fired in Popeyes. Uh, I don't know. My mama don't cook fried chicken. Oh, so. she don't. No, oh, she oh, don't. Dang man, come on, mom. <laughs> yeah. What a chicken. She don't. Uh nah. Popeyes is the best fried. Like KFC, KFC been hey, they trash to me. <laughs> they got some good mashed potatoes. They be having some soggy chicken sometimes. They, they be too greasy. Yeah, churches be greasy, but I like churches. I, don't I fool with churches, churches a little, like you know. Sometimes I fool. I used to eat them a lot. <coughs> I can't, like Popeyes, like they they the, they the best, like hands down. Fried By the way, joint. For me. There's a place called Churches Chicken, guys. So when we say churches, we're talking about like an actual chicken joint. I pr- I'm pretty sure they know. Some people might not know about churches. I mean, like true. churches, they're like something they eat chicken at church. Like no, I mean it's churches, churches, chicken. It's churches, other places too. I feel like <laughs> I don't I don't know how big of a franchise it is. I mean, like a lot of places they like. Cause you know, like checkers, checkers yeah. here is like rallies, other places. Yeah, and like Hardee's is Carl Carl Juniors, like other places. Carl Juniors, that's yeah. what they call it. like in California is Carl Juniors, but it's the same thing. <laughs> it's the same thing as Hardee's. It's Hardee's, but it's just it's called Carl Juniors, like it's not Yo, called Hardee's. Zacadoos, bro. I like their. Uh, you ever tried their own yeah. tenders? Yeah. yeah. But me and me and my boy Ant, like we used to get after, every day after class, in between classes, we'll go get a twenty piece, bro. <laughs> we, bro, we we'll go get yeah. a twenty piece with some. Well, they, didn't they change their name? Yeah, it was that, Macadoos. Yeah, they had to change it for like some copyright purposes. But yeah, so yeah, we used to get we'll get the Zach sauce. Well, it's it, crazy. It, it's not really Zach sauce. Yeah, it's crazy. They got their own sauce, but it's like Zach sauce. It's pretty much like I think it's they called it that though. They, uh, I don't it know. was like Macadoo sauce or something like that. Mac when, back when they had the M, but now it's like now I think it's called Zach sauce. Just their name spelled different than Zach, you know. Zach and Dude's, of course, spelled different than Zaxby's. Yeah, it is. But um, I don't know. They probably changed the name to avoid issues with that too. So I don't know. Probably, probably. But, yeah, I used to get a twenty piece from there like almost every day for lunch. Um, and that, yeah, get like two things of ranch. They got some good wings. They got wings at yeah. I know they had wings there. Yeah, they I thought they just had tenders. They got a lot. They got hamburgers, <coughs> wings. Hey, man, slimy one of them waters from behind you though. They got uh, slimy one of them waters. Hook your boy up. Yeah, appreciate that. Yeah, they got wings. Okay, like yeah. Checkers has wings too. They just got plain. They have plain wings or something. And yeah, you can get like different flavors. I think. Yeah, I think you can get different flavors. Okay, or maybe you can just get buffalo. I'm not. I can't remember. I have, I have to check it out when I go back. I'm, I'm trying to eat a few more like meaty products. Before I go back, um, vegetarian. I'm gonna try to get get into some try some wings out, man. Before I go back, going back to back. that life. I'm going back, man. I'm gonna miss you. I'm going back, man. I'm gonna miss you, my brother. <laughs> more, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna, I'm gonna miss the chicken and stuff like that. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to just cook more. Yeah. Um, and try yeah. to you know imitate the flavors, some of the flavors of the um, my stuff. You gotta do what you gotta do. Like, yeah, man. I felt better when I was vegetarian. My body felt better. So I I just want to go back for those purposes. Yeah, maybe one day I'll try it. 
Yeah, I'm, try, not, I'm not ready yet. I'm not ready good. yet. They they get um that's what NFL players do. A lot of professional sports players do. They go vegetarian sometimes before like a week before the game or a few days before the game. They just be vegetarian. Uh, it helps clean the body out. It helps you you know. You become you just your system doesn't have to do much work as far as like breaking down materials because meat stays in your body for like three to four days. Mm-hmm. It takes a while to break it down. Vegetables only vegetables and fruits they digest within like an hour to two hours. So your your body don't. That's why you feel so tired after Thanksgiving meal eating all that meat and stuff. Yeah, your body like pumping out acids trying to break that stuff down like over hours and days at a time. So that's why you feel so drained and sluggish a few days after Thanksgiving. But if you're just eating vegetables. Couple of, maybe a couple of hours, your body dump out a little bit of acid, break that stuff down, put it, send it out to the parts your body needs to go to. Now you got extra energy left over, so then you're not as drained. And that's why I, that's just part of the research. But that's why I did a lot of my research, and that's why I was like almost four years in on being a vegetarian. But <laughs> I started missing fried chicken too much, so <laughs> hey. I hit up my own McDonald's for some meat chickens real hard the first day back eating meat. What's your favorite? Like meat, like chicken, fish, beef. First, my favorite meat. Yeah. Um, I did say uh, I don't know, man. I like. I prefer, like chicken, like as far as meats go. I yeah. love fish as well. I'm not um, big on fish. Chicken is probably my my favorite. Yeah. It, yeah, it's probably my favorite to eat. Chicken. Chicken. Yeah, I I love. I guess because it's the texture situation. Because it's beef was chicken, and and chicken was beef. I would choose beef. It's just a texture situation. <laughs> I know that sounds. <laughs> I know that sounds confusing, but you if, said if beef was chicken, the and chicken, chicken was, was beef, beef. I would choose beef. You would choose beef. Yeah. So you still choose chicken. No. Yeah. Wait. You do. What? Wait. Because you said if beef was chicken, if and beef chicken was beef was chicken. Like if beef would. got switched over, and beef was where the spot chicken was. Wait. What? You know, hold on, wait. Maybe I'm confusing myself. <laughs> okay, put it this way: I eat freaking. I, I like beef and I like chicken. Let's say that. But if the textures were switched between the two, then beef would be. My oh, oh, you know what oh, I'm saying? Yeah, okay, if the okay, flavor okay, was okay. still there, but the texture yeah. was switched up, yeah, yeah, okay. I would be on a different side. So the, it's the texture. That's yeah, true. I like the texture of chicken, but All I right. also like. Remember, I told you I like meatloaf, but I also like the I taste meatloaf. of. Like, it would just uh, It's a battle Maybe it's just nasty. It's I'm just disgusting. gonna blend them up In a blender And eat them together It's know. nasty man. I went to <laughs> I remember I remember when I went To my friend's house I'm not gonna say Who friend it was Oh no <laughs> I remember I went to his house When I was a kid And his mom made meatloaf And I was like The worst time I was like I don't wanna eat this You gotta let I, You gotta let Mo Make you some meatloaf bro. I hate meatloaf Yo let Mo oh She makes some fine meatloaf bro it's, I don't uh, I have to try it again I haven't had it in a while But I don't, I don't know, just think about it because it's like ketchup. I'm like, why? Is ketchup <laughs> like, why y'all put ketchup? It's me. It's like a think about uh, ketchup no, on your bro. burger. You Ew, know what I'm but it's not. Ah, it's just, no, but it's no. like a big. It's like look, you gotta have meatloaf with something, man. You gotta have it with some sides, man. You slice your meatloaf. You get some nice thin slices. You get some mac and cheese or something, or some green beans or, or a roll. I don't, I don't really you know what I'm saying, meatloaf, bro. I'm sorry. You fool with rolls? No rolls. Oh, especially the rolls from Texas Roadhouse. Oh, have I had them bad boys? Oh, those are lovely. I don't know if I had them. They're lovely. Them. You got you can you can go there just to get the rolls. <laughs> you can buy the rolls. Like yo, Red Lobster. They got biscuits. Yeah, the biscuits. Those biscuits at Red Lobster. Yeah, they. But probably. you eat the biscuits and you leave. <laughs> them and them and Popeye's biscuits. Popeye, yeah, them things be buttery. Right. I'm saying, like, which one? Oh, Red Lobster biscuits over Popeye's. Yes. Biscuits. I don't know. It's a high, it's a higher quality restaurant. Man, pissed, no, I don't know, bro. Like yeah. Popeyes biscuits, Popeyes be, biscuits be like pillows, but still buttery. Like they be buttery and soft, good. but still them them soft buttery, <laughs> nicely seasoned cheddar cheddar styled red lobster biscuits though. Yeah, they good. They good. Come on, man. They, I, I give some. They good. <laughs> they real good. I, I love red lobster biscuits. Yeah, you got you do got to try like the Texas Roadhouse House rolls though. Like, they are very, very, very delicious. Okay, okay. trust me, they are. They are. I'll try it. Out. I'll try it. Out. I'll try it. Out. Well, y'all, um, <laughs> we could go on for hours talking about food. I love food. Yes. So you need it to survive. So I mean, I love to eat. Like I just love to eat, bro. So yeah, you in my could, belly. Could talk about food for a long time. But oh, pig in a blanket. I just had to say it right before we ended. I love picking the blanket. 
I don't really like Sweet, sweet. Oh, I'm good. I'm take that blanket. <laughs> I used to eat like those little like small cocktail wieners when I was a kid a lot though. Oh yeah, yeah. My you ever had those barbecue? Yeah, barbecue weenies. Yeah, they usually have those at like weddings or whatever. I like, yeah, like, like wedding receptions. Like, yeah, finger food type joint places, yeah. events. Barbecue meatballs. Oh, meatballs! My favorite freaking meatball sub. Yeah, we're going forever about this. Dude. I don't like meatballs <laughs> like that. Man. I like meatballs. Yo, if you don't like, if you don't, don't like meatballs, like meatball subs. please unfollow now. I don't like meatball subs. <laughs> I like meatballs by themselves though. Meatballs by themselves, like dipped in barbecue sauce. Those okay. are good. Yeah, we could talk about this for a long time because we're. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I love eating. I love food. Maybe I eat too much. I do sometimes. <laughs> I know a lot of times I do eat the wrong things a lot. Eating for pleasure, man. Well, no, I don't. I don't think I eat. For you, you eat to survive. I do, but I was like, ain't nobody think about surviving. Not many people think about surviving when they eat. No, yeah, it is some people. Cause my dad I said some people do. And my dad had brought it up, bro. Like when I was in high school, I was like, "Why they don't want to eat?" He was like, "Some people eat just because they have to, not because they like to." I had never thought about that before. I was like, "Dang!" He was like, "You eat because you love it. You like to eat. Yeah, you love to eat." But they eat just because they know they need to survive. Just a quick little education moment, educational moment for you guys out there. Um, sometimes I just want to let you guys know, like, if you eat, you can eat a Big Mac and still be hungry. Like, you can eat a Big Mac, a whole meal, like a Big Mac, large fry, large drink, and you can still be hungry. Um, and the reason why, oh, you can still be hungry like a couple, like an hour later, two hours later, you can still be hungry, wanting food. But the reason why is because I've learned that if you don't give your body what it wants. What it needs, like nutrition, like if you don't give it the right nutrition that it is looking for, yeah, it'll still crave. Yeah, so I it's mean, like that's, you, that's, that's why you got to make sure you be smart and eat for fast food. eat for necessity, eat um eat what's necessary, not eat what's pleasurable. Yeah, and that's why I struggle like a lot. Yeah. A that's lot. why people find themselves still hungry eating meal after meal all day. Yeah, that's what that's what fast food does to you. Yeah, it's not really fulfilling or filling. It just kind of like just to. For a moment in time, but uh, moment yeah. in time. We hope you guys enjoyed this. We talked about food the whole episode, I think, and uh, we yeah. just <laughs> we love food, and we, love food. we hope y'all love food just as much as us, if not more. Hashtag Team Meatball in the comments. If you yeah, with the meatballs, uh, I'm good. I like, I like meatballs. <laughs> I just don't like meatball soaps. It feels weird eating the meatball soap to me. So what? Your, so what you gonna hashtag? What you want them to hashtag for your if they on your team? Wings. So hashtag wings if you're on Eric's team. Hashtag meatballs if you're on the meatballs team. <laughs> Let go. Yeah. For that, sure. For sure. Let's go. <laughs> like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. Do all that. What else, my boy? Check what else? Up. What else they need to do? Comment in the comments. Comment in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> and uh yeah, just share. Or you already said share. And, yeah. Uh, just all the all the above. Keep listening. Keep sharing your love. Supporting. Appreciate y'all. Heck yeah, man. Love y'all. Y'all keep y'all gonna keep us growing. We're gonna keep y'all keep you know entertainment coming to y'all. And we out. Until next time. Peace. Peace. And love. Alright, bro. Alright, man. Easy. Easy my man. <laughs>